Hey guys, it's Renee. Welcome to Zers for the Weekend. Today, I wanted to share with you a super, super simple yet really effective and delicious recipe. It's actually one of my favorite ones from my childhood. So the first ingredient we're going to be using is a pomegranate. I'm just going to start by cutting it to open it. And once I open it, I'm just going to take all the goodness out of it. And there are a lot of ways to open it. My mom uh, taught me one and then on the internet I found a couple of other ones. But honestly, the best way that I found is by kind of squishing it as if it was an orange. And because my mom once told me that this is really like, it tends to stain. So the least I can touch it, the better. So I just use a wooden spoon and just tap it a bit. To just get it out. So if you notice I'm working on my sink and I'm using a huge bowl, kind of an ugly one, a plastic one, because it can get kind of messy and just to avoid to clean after that. Once everything is out I just clean the kind of um, white stuff, I don't really know how to call it, but to so just stay or keep the good stuff with you because at the end of the day that's what you're going to be eating. So just try to clean the most that you can. And then what I do is just pour it into a plate. And then here I just prepare the whole thing. So my bowl pretty much is just to, you know, take all the, the goodness out. I'm here I'm just going to add one teaspoon of powdered cinnamon and pretty much two teaspoons of sugar. And this is regular sugar, granulated sugar. And you can actually add more if you want. I ended up adding half of it. Depends pretty much on how sweet you want it. So just pretty much test it as you go. And then just mix until everything is incorporated. At some point, cinnamon kind of looks like it's not going to be mixing like ever. But it takes time and you just have to keep on mixing until you get to the good stuff, which is this thing. And then to serve it, I just serve it into these mini plates. And just pretty much add one tablespoon or two or how much you want or your guest wants. And because this is not like the most appealing dessert that you've ever seen, I just like to garnish with some cinnamon. But that's pretty much it. I just want to share this one because it's really good. Just have to try it. Thank you so much for watching. It was so much fun making this one, even though it's super easy. But yeah, I just want to share with you this. And uh, if you liked it, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more stuff. And share it if you find it helpful and give it a try. It's really good. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys.